Hello everyone, today on our Toy Box special video we will be taking a look at Bell's Village Rescue, which was my top 5 entering box from Beauty and the Beast, it reached number 4. So to start off we have to find Bell in the village. Here we're exploring a little bit of the village, so you can take a look at it. I divided the forest and the village, as you can see. Now we go to this question mark and we shall see Bell. Gaston found a dark spot that has unleashed dark creatures on the land. Stop them. And so we start attacking our fancy bears over here with the amazing Princess Leia. Fitting for all the Star Wars hype going on, right? So here is basically a simple combat section with bears. Um, they are a bit spread out throughout the village, so you have to walk throughout the village because some of them might hide in the village. I'm gonna get these first. These ones with shield can sometimes be a little annoying, but we can get through them. We can do this. Come on. As you can see on the distance, there's a few enemies. Don't forget to destroy the green balls too. Those can be other annoying enemies as well. Here's this bear running around. We gotcha. We can stop his spell blooming these magic trees in the forest. So now we're going to the forest. Your village will pay for your actions. And Gaston is on top of that big spooky mountain. Proceed to the forest. You don't really have to walk to the forest, I teleport you to the forest. And you can begin your mission by blooming 10 magic trees using Bell. Do not lose Bell. After that, you'll go in a platforming section to climb the mountain. Again, making sure you understand the gameplay. So you have a horse so you can get to the trees fast, and then you grab Bell and throw her in. Now, on 3.0, this game is actually a bit more easier, because if you lose Bell, you can always use your sidekick. So that's pretty cool, you can just use your sidekick for this gameplay. Oops, sorry. But yeah, you're gonna notice the trees that you need to throw Bell in are glowing, so that's one way to guide you on how to find them. See though, there's a little bit of glow in the distance, here's the glow. And that way we can find our trees much faster. Here you will find some bears and enemies walking around attacking you, so be sure to take care of them. Bell sometimes goes and attacks them, which can be pretty cool but also dangerous. So always be extra careful with that. But with Leia it's great because you can shoot while riding the horse so you don't have to get out of the horse. And this becomes a little nice little adventure in the forest. This was something pretty new for me. I never used Town Spells and Doors that much before when I made this on 2.0. So it was a nice little experiment I did. So there we go. We have a couple more. Yeah, there's there's a couple on each side of the mountain. We can see at least two over here. There should be two more around. There we go. Come on, Bell, come on. Okay. Thankfully we took out a lot of enemies, but there are still enemies running around. Ah! No, 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 come on, Bell. No, Bell, where are you going? Okay, we go over here. Yeah, over here. Boom. Boom. Boom, boom, pew, pew, pew. <laughs> anyway. Yeah, we're gonna last one. Here we go. Can't see. Ah. And boom. Find it. I will prepare a new spell. So we finished the first spot, now we're going to the platforming part. It's pretty simple, it's not that complex. 
Um, unfortunately, doing toy box, doing moving platforms can be a bit difficult because they go out of rhythm with no apparent reason. It just does, no matter how well you save the moving platform. So, for this. For this 3.0 version, I decided to add clouds, so that way you can wait for the moving platform to come in the cloud. Of course, the clouds don't stay there forever, but they are a great support to make you wait a little bit more and try different routes. There's different ways to reach the top, you don't really have to do what I'm doing here, you can just take another path, I make sure there's definitely endless ways to get. We're almost here. Uh oh. Oh. Ooh. What? Wait. Wait. Oh. Ugh. Okay. I got an idea. See, you just have to carefully time your jumps, thinking on the moving platform that's coming. And there we go. Now we just wait for this one to go up again, and we cross the bridge. Now we proceed over here. We're gonna climb the last bit. Whoa, uh, oops, excuse me. Excuse me, arrow. And here we are. And we are here. You grab Gaston and you throw him into the well. Congratulations, you stopped Gaston. Thanks for playing. And that's pretty much it for Bell's Village Rescue. It's a pretty simple box, but a little different thing I wanted to try. So anyway, thank you for watching and see you next time.